Thank you very much for clicking on my video. A quick word before we begin. If you are new to Trove or wish to start a new account, feel free to use the first link in this video's description. You'll help the channel greatly. What's up guys, welcome back to Trove, welcome back to my main account, welcome back to me doing some, or rather getting some more mastery today. And uh, I know this is like, quite a challenge getting mastery on my, uh, on my main since we're on 667 uh, 67 already. We're mostly free to playing uh, accounts so of... Um, I'm not really into the pack game, so yeah, squeezing mastery points is um, pretty difficult. But I, had a, uh, I have an idea for today, and that is... Mm, well, it's certainly not gonna bring us 670, I'd be really curious to see what this uh, reward looks like. Guinea Vier the Gold Hard. Hopefully we can still get a decent amount of uh, mastery points today, and we're gonna do so by visiting the hub, yeah. Believe it or not, I'm gonna end up with mastery um, on my main through visiting the hub. Have you guessed it <laughs> where I'm gonna be heading? Well, of course, it's gonna be the uh, brand new update. I'm gonna check the uh, Paragon Trader. What's its name? Celestian Paragon Provisioner. There you go. That's that's a lengthy, uh, that's a long name. But let's see what's for sale. Let's see what's for sale. No, not you actually. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. I, I, I don't have any business with you. Instead, hmm, this is weird. The the, the credits are uh, are not grayed out, even though I have none. Hmm. Anyway, uh, the thing I want to actually visit, and I just realized we had one, uh, we had one such workbench in our club as well, is this. Anyway, Paragon workbench. I want to craft some things in here, such as these. No, not the banner. Such as this, Walton and Starbird and whatever. But we should probably choose our items carefully, cause uh, I want to get as many master points as. Oh, Celestia Paragon wings. Ah, never mind, I, I I don't even have the Atrovian loops necessary for this one, so uh, that's gonna be a skip. Wow. Holy crap, some of these are really expensive, what the heck? Atrovian loops. Worded for each Paragon level earned. Oh, god damn, what have I done? I guess I haven't learned... I haven't earned so many Paragon levels lately. I'm only on 57... I should... <laughs> I should advance my class some more. It's such a shame, we don't, we barely have things for allies. How many allies? I guess I can get these three. Can we get world? No. So we can only get three allies. I don't even know how many more. Oh my god, they're even, <laughs> they're even asking for a couple of paragon marks. Oh god damn. Anyway, out of curiosity, Mr. Walton, how much mastery do you give? Oh, oh, never mind, this is good, this is good. Starry. Star. Okay, so that's gonna be at least 150 master points. That's fine with me. So what I'm gonna be doing next is, uh, well, probably getting some more flux, since as far as I know, <laughs> these Paragon's marks are uh, rather expensive. As you can see, I'm on zero, right? And I'll be needing six. And that's gonna be like six million or something. Let's see, Paragon. Paragons. Uh, slightly below 6 million, but <laughs> still pretty expensive. As a matter of fact, now I'm thinking. Now I think it would be a much better idea to just wait and not do this now. I'm gonna save this clip and uh, wait a few more weeks until I get enough trophy and loops to craft this. I'm gonna go right for the wings. I mean, these are gonna be much more exciting than three random allies. Even though these are gonna be like 150 master points, I don't feel like spending 5 million flux for that. <laughs> no, not at all. Well, 4.8 million. No, that's a big no. Um, that said, I'm willing to spend lots of flux for the wings. See you in a few months. I guess not sure when I'm gonna be uh, leveling uh, my class up, I guess. Enough for me to get, what, 30, 25, 55 more Trovian loops. Well, see you once that's done. What's up guys, welcome back to Trove, welcome back to my main account, I haven't even finished for the game to load cause I'm fairly excited for this one. Uh, today we're gonna be crafting one of the rarest wings in game, 
Yeah, they're called the freaking Celestial Paragon Wings. They take, as you may uh, see from here, they uh, they will ask you for 125 Shovian Loops, 1.5 a Radiant Shard. Honestly, this resource is laughable, it's not expensive. But they will also ask you for 5 Paragons Mark at the same time. This is... Um, this is gonna be the most expensive resource, as a matter of fact, as you can see right here, I got zero. Which can only mean one thing, if I was to go to the marketplace... Uh, Mark. There you go. <laughs> this is actually more than I thought, I thought this was gonna be one million flux, and I thought this, the cost for this video is gonna be like five million flux, but apparently not. Apparently not. Um, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt, guys. Bam. 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 Watch my flux disappear. Watch my flux disappear. How much flux did I just spend? 1.5 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. No way. I, I thought I, I thought it was eight million, seven point five million flux basically. I mean, um, I technically didn't buy them all at one point five, but let's just say I've just spent seven point five million flux on these. Now I have second thoughts. Now I have the buyer's remorse, as a matter of fact. Seven point five freaking million flux for a pair of wings. What was I thinking? No, really, uh, the point of this video was to spend like 5 million flux and say, oh my god, 5 million flux wings, but now it's 7.5 million, there's like a giveaway prize on top. Frick. Whatever. <laughs> this is annoying. Anyway, guess, guess we at least have access to these Celestial Paragon wings, uh, which only g get you like what? 100,000, no, I wish it was 100,000 mastery points, they only get you like 100 mastery points and that's not even gonna be enough for a level up at my uh, at my current level, so you know what, let me, oh, could you buy these from, oh my god, I got so scared, I got so freaking scared, because uh, I've seen the button, right, and some of these items, well, no, I don't think you can buy any of these from the market. God damn, what a freaking scare uh, I, I, I just went through. I thought these were actually tradable and uh, for a brief second I thought if they're tradable, what if, what if they're under 7.5 million flux and I got scammed live on video? It wouldn't be the first time that would have happened. God damn, that was close. But uh, fortunately not, fortunately this is just a random bug with a um, tradable thing. Okay, so, <laughs> so we're in the green I suppose. As in, we didn't quite, uh, we didn't uh, quite get scammed. Actually, I did quite get scammed because I've looked like a few days ago, and these were one million flux. Now, when I'm making the video, they're freaking 1.5. Whatever. Paragon's mark. I have everything I need to craft these wings, and I'm just gonna click on craft, get my 100 mastery points, and hope to God, hope to God, these wings are actually epic. I kinda know what they look like, but I'm not entirely sure. So, Celestial Paragon Wings, it took ages to get these, because these require like, what, 125 level ups? Something like that, because you get, what, you get one Trovian loop per level up. Imagine that. And you have to get like 125 separate levels. I don't know about you, but it takes me a while to get a level. It's like going from level 29 to level 30, as far as I understand, right? Because right? it's asking for 3 million experience. So imagine leveling up a class from 29 to 30, 125 times, because that's why I did. Unless I'm missing something out, but I'm pretty sure that's why I did, right? Because I'm on 98 Lunar Lancer and I barely get to get these Celestial Paragon Wings. Granted, I've unlocked some other re or rewards in the uh, in the meantime, but this is the um, this is the hardest, right? Oh my god, this is even harder. What? Uh... Well, it's cheaper Paragon Mark wise. I got the wings, whatever. Be happy with what I'm gonna show you, cause... Oh my god, it took ages to get these. And I've spent 7.5 million flux. Watch me get disappointed at the, at the way they look. I don't even know their name, Celestial. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna go to fans and stuff recently acquired Celestial Paragon Wings. What do they say? The pinnacle of flight? Ah, this is a good description. It, it's setting us up for something amazing. 
please be cool, please be cool, please be cool. Okay, 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 yeah. Not bad. They got some ugliness to them. Yeah, of course I've seen them in the past. I've seen them on PS as well, I've played with them there. Um, they got some ugly ugliness to them, but at the same time the amount of VFX kinda makes up for it. So in that sense, it's kind no, it's not even uh, on zero, so to speak. They're actually good, I like them, I like them and... Um, I'm pretty sure I will be using these from now, just cause I spent 7.5 million flux on them and many months of grinding. Ah, I can't say they are underwhelming, cause they're not. They are definitely not underwhelming, they're just something uh, different. <laughs> Let's just say they are different. Okay. Wonder how they look on the uh, Pegasus mount, just a second, let me show you. Uh, princess, Prancy. Princess, Prancy, Prance. Okay, I... Yeah, they don't quite fit it. No, they do not fit that mount. But there you have them. These are not the hardest wings to get. I think there's another p pair of wings harder to get. I'm still gonna say these are hard because these are technically hard to get, right? Um, but what was the other pair of wings that's even harder? <laughs> I think the Fremo Bergen. Yeah, I think these from the uh, Bergen PS. How many wings am I missing? As a matter of fact. I'm missing one mastery. <gasps> oh my god, where do I get these from? I'm missing, uh, missing a pair of wings coming from the mastery points. Just a second. Now oh, it's probably under the 701 800 uh, um, reward pool. So I'm not gonna be seeing them anytime soon. Oiled alerons. They sound good. They sound good. So what else am I missing? Smoking skulls of battle. Oh, this is the Bamba Royale. Yeah, they're not technically hard. I, j I just can't be bothered. I mean, they are hard, but not that hard. Wings of the Phoenix. This is from a pack, as far as I know. Oh, these are all from packs. These are all from packs, so never mind them. They can be bought easily, which I should do. There's like 500 mastery points locked behind that. Um, but these are gonna be the hard... Oh, whoa, Sander Daplands. Hey, I should probably craft these. These are crossable. I didn't... <laughs> I've never got bothered um, uh, to understand, basically, how to craft these. Even though I don't quite understand how to craft these, I don't think they're harder to craft than... Um, or rather, harder to, ob to be obtained than the Primal Paragon Wings. I believe these are the most expensive... And the hardest primal paragon wings. Anyway, we got the second best. <laughs> Not even sure if I can call them like that, but we got these celestial paragon wings. Finally, they look better uh, during nighttime. Actually, look at the sparks. I didn't. Uh, I wasn't able to read the sparks during the daytime. Yeah. So there you have them. There you have it. Seven point five million flux was born today. To entertain you with these wings. Hope you enjoy it. Hope you appreciate it. Or not. I'm just kidding, of course. I, uh, I'm having fun with these myself also. Thank you so, so much for watching. That is gonna be it for today. Because I don't think there's anything else to mention. But to show you what, what I just got, right? And uh, yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. I will see you on the next one. Thank you very much for watching this video, remember to like it if you enjoyed it, dislike it if you did not, and don't forget to leave a comment saying, well, anything that crosses your mind. This will help the channel greatly, I'll see you on the next one.